to our fall concert. My name is Laura Fuller, and I'm excited to welcome you today to the first ever BHS virtual concert experience. Our choirs have been working hard to learn music both in person and over Zoom to present to you today. After mastering their music, each student submitted a video recording of themselves singing, and our choir directors put those videos together to create the performance that you will hear tonight. Our concert explores the music of social justice movements throughout American history from the civil rights movement to the equal pay battle today. This music has inspired us to rise for social justice, for truth and compassion everywhere. We hope it inspires you too. Freestyle will be singing Bend the Ark, written by Minnesota composer Wendy Buck. The text of the song is inspired by the famous Martin Luther King Jr. speech, How Long, Not Long. On March 21st, 1965, Martin Luther King Jr. led a march to the capital of Alabama to demand an end to segregation. Protected by the National Guard, 25,000 people marched the steps of Montgomery to demand equal rights. Martin Luther King Jr. gave a speech filled with hope and conviction, declaring that the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends towards justice. This song encourages us to bend the arc and bring justice one step closer today. We're on the move now. Yes, sir. Like an idea whose time has come. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Not even the marching of mighty armies can halt us. Yes, sir. We're moving to the land of freedom. Yes, sir. I know you're asking today, how long will it take? Somebody's asking, how long will prejudice blind the visions of men? I come to say to you this afternoon, however difficult the moment, yes, sir. however frustrating the hour, it will not be long no, because truth crushed earth will rise again. Yes, sir. How long, not long, yes, sir. because no lie can live forever. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. How long, not long, yes, because you shall reap what you sow. Yes, sir. How long, How not long. long. How long? Truth forever on the scaffold, wrong forever on the throne. Yes, sir. Yet that scaffold sways the future. Yes, Behind the dim unknown standeth God within the shadow, keeping watch above his own. How long, not long. Because the arc of the moral universe is long, but it bends toward justice. Yes, How long, not long. Bend the ark and break the ceiling. Bend the ark and break the ceiling. Human rights for human beings. Human rights for human beings. Bend the ark and break the ceiling. Bend the ark and break the ceiling. Human rights for human beings. Human rights for human beings. Bend the ark, bend the ark. Bend the ark, bend the ark. Next, it's freshman choir singing I Lift My Voice. This piece was written and composed by Andrea Ramsey. It is full of encouragement for the listener. I Lift My Voice reminds us that we can use our voice for good and fight for what is right. This song helps us remember that when you stand up for what is right, you never stand alone. Our class practiced composing by writing our own third verse. We are excited for you to hear our song. When I lift my voice, let it be in song. A defiant note in the face of wrong. I won't stand alone, we'll stand side by side. Cause we know that love is always justified. When they try to divide us, it will only unite us. I won't stand alone, we'll stand 
El Canto is proud to present the song Rise, written by Arian Abella. The powerful lyrics of this song challenge the singer and the listener to rise up and stand for justice. Each phrase reminds us the values of truth, kindness, and compassion. While learning this song, we discuss the importance of rising against hatred and spreading love to others and ourselves. As you watch, you will notice that we added action to the lyrics of this song. Many of these actions are translated from American Sign Language. We enjoy challenging ourselves to learn a little bit of ASL and hope that you enjoy our piece. I will rise with all my daughters. I will rise against my foes. I will rise with all the mothers. I will carry all their woes. I will rise to fight for freedom. I will rise to face with fear. I will rise against all hatred. While my eyes are veiled in tears, oh, stand with me, rise up hand in hand, oh, stand with me, we will rise to spread Blaze Choir will be singing More Waters Rising, written by Sarah Lynch Thomason. This piece talks about the challenges we face in life. Sometimes it feels like we will never overcome the difficulties ahead of us. However, this song reminds us that we have the strength within ourselves to overcome anything. During class, we were able to discuss the meaning of the song and wrote our own verse. This verse reminds the listener that there is always hope. Please enjoy More Waters Rising. There are more waters rising this I know, this I know. There are more waters rising this I know. There are more waters rising, they will find their way to me. There are more waters rising this I know. There are more fires burning this I know, this I know. This fall, Concert Choir has learned about the history of Black Americans through the lens of music. We will be singing Lift Every Voice and Sing, written by brothers James Weldon and James Rosemont Johnson. Written in the year 1900, this powerful anthem recognized the heavy burden of segregation and racism in America. 
but looked forward with hope to a brighter future for all Americans. While learning this song, we discussed the importance of understanding our past to create a brighter future. We are honored to sing this piece for you today. Lift every voice and sing, till earth and heaven ring, ring with the harmonies of liberty. Let all rejoicing rise high as the listening skies, let it resound loud as the rolling sea. Sing. Our second piece, the Star Spangled Banner, became the national anthem for the United States in 1931, over 100 years after it was composed. The Star Spangled Banner recognized the heroic efforts of American soldiers as they defended Fort McHenry from the British in the War of 1812. The final line continues to serve souls long after the song ends. Oh say, does that Star Spangled Banner yet wave, or the land of the free and the home of the brave. Oh, say, can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we held at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and 